My name is Brett Seelove. I'm a cardiologist uh, here at the Meridian Cardiovascular Network. Men and women uh, combined should be very, very serious about their heart health, starting from, again, a very early age. I think one thing that's really important to reiterate is the importance of women, as well as men, seeking medical attention way before a disease process or a disease comes to fruition. Every minute or so, either a mother, a maternal cousin, a daughter dies of heart disease in the United States. Most people think that this would never happen to a woman. Their disease symptoms are typically a little bit atypical or not typical more than men. So I think it's really critical to talk about awareness when it comes to women and heart disease and men and heart disease. Women are not impervious to disease. Neither are children for that matter, or teenagers or college students. There's never an early time to get evaluated for heart disease, but more so about where are some of these risks that may predispose you to the disease itself. 70 to 80 percent of it is treatable and preventable. Um, and that's really one of the things that I try to hammer across all patients that I see. Talk to your medical professional, talk to your family members about how to seek medical attention and be aware of this disease that will affect all of us as we get older. I love the idea about bringing a heart healthy lifestyle into the home. Because again, this disease does not affect a grandparent, a parent, or just a child. It will and can affect all generations. So I think it's important to bring it to the household. Some things are minimizing TV, going for long walks before dinner, getting rid of the caffeinated or decaffeinated carbonated sodas that we drink all the time, fat-containing, cholesterol-containing foods. So I think it does start at the pantry and also translates into trying to getting up and go instead of using our devices and our remote controls too often.